Sido, you must look back at this season and wonder how it all happened. Yeah, um, it's been a crazy season and ups and downs and my breakthrough into the first team, which I didn't expect to go the way I did, but I thank God for everything that's happened and I'm here is because of the hard work and dedication I've put through and also from the help from the teammates, the staff, and also for the fans for making it easier for me to go out there and perform. When you were going through your rehab last summer after your injury, yeah. could you even have imagined that you'd end up being the top goal scorer, winning the Young Player of the Year, any of those things had happened? For none of that at all. I think that the only thing that was going through my head at the time was just get back stronger, come back fitter and prove everyone wrong that thought the, the injury would have kept me out and I wouldn't come back the same. So I was, I was having my own battles in my head, but I didn't imagine it to go as the way it has. So I just thank God as well for giving, back, giving me so much strength to come back stronger and, and more hungry. Of course, you had your under-21 debut as well. It's difficult to remember all these landmarks, but yeah. it, that's another great thing for you to have experienced. Yeah, exactly. I, I didn't expect that as well to come up. Um, getting picked for England 21s was such, such a big thing for me. That was another target, but my main target was just to get back stronger and fitter. And if you had to be going out alone, playing, I just wanted to just get back to do on what I love doing. And because I, I haven't played football, it was for, for a couple of months. That's what I wanted to do. And and the way it's gone, it's just been brilliant. brilliant. You had some great moments as well during the season. What What's your pick? What's your favourite moment? I think the best moment for me would be scoring my hat-trick against Newport where my mother was there and he put me put me on the map really. I think some people may say my United goal but I think scoring a hat trick the way I did in the first half, he really I remember that night. It was really a great night for me. The one that sticks in my mind is New Year's Day, almost last minute penalty. There's quite a few experienced players on the pitch and up your step and, and scored the penalty to win the game and that was a massive moment. Yeah, I think, yeah, I think um, that day I was feeling really confident and I, f I remember having a chat with Keith before the game and I was surprised I wasn't starting but I got the call at half time and um, when the penalty shout came I just thought why not, I haven't missed the penalty this season, I've talked to you already. So I, I took it and and I thank the senior pros for letting me do it as well because um, I think some, some wanted to take it but because I was confident and they could see it in my face so they allowed me to do it and I just was thankful for it to go in.